Hey guys, this is Stephanie and the Amendment Little She Shed doing an unboxing. Today is going to be a short unboxing. Um, uh, this is my first order from my new little essay, which I'm excited about. She's very ambitious. Um, I've already been offered a, 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 an exclusive piece and in which I will take advantage of that and will more than likely be my birthday bag. The crudetar, the cherry on the top, all that good stuff. But let's get to the unboxing, right? Um, I've already pulled the tab off. For some reason, I'm having issues with camera. So, let's get to the rest of it. Of course, um, when you buy a little SLG from uh, Louis Vuitton, straight from Louis, that are um, from the boutique and this and but anyway, it comes in this beautiful box about Louis Vuitton. Uh, this is what the box is usually more like. Uh, just so you'll know, because if you purchase on pre-loves, you really want to know that. Um, so here are our two little jewels. And let's just slide those out. I'm going to set those down, and we'll do those individually. So, and I'm very excited about this because, and of course, it's my paperwork. Thank you, Donna. Um, very excited about this because unless you go in the store, you just can't get one. Now, I've tried 10 ways to, you know what, to um, get the spoon frame and lights on boxes messed up. But, um, 10 ways to heck to get um, the um, monogram key pouch. And um, And I really haven't discussed my YouTube um, adventures with um, with my essay in before I give out my um, give out her information. I really uh, would like to talk to her about that first, so I'm gonna put that away. But um, yeah, see, I got a receipt. All that good stuff. So, yay, yay, that's what comes with it. Let's get to looking at the pieces. Oh, yes, let's get the pieces. Oh my goodness. I know, it's so retarded to get so excited about key plays, or key pouches, is what they're called. And, um, but like I said, you know, my nearest store is Saks in Birmingham or either um, the Linux Mall in Atlanta. And um, I really don't want to drive all that way just to get a key pouch, you know. I mean, if I'm going to get a special piece, that's different, you know. So, let's get back to you. My goodness. There we go. And also, if you're looking to get an essay, you got to go online and spend some money. Don't just walk up in there and say, hey, I need to be an essay. Or call up and say, hey, can y'all give me an essay? Can you hook me up? Hook a sister up? And you can't just call somebody else's essay anyway. You've got to have a history with Louis Vuitton. I mean, you have to have a history with Hermes, don't you? You have to have a history with Chanel or any of the other top houses. So that's how you get an, an, an essay. You purchase enough online, um, and then you call up and you say, and there's no real set amount or anything, but um, you can call customer service for any of those companies, and they'll let you know if you qualify for an essay, okay? Um, but if you've not purchased a, a, a few things from them, don't even bother to ask about an essay because it's not going to happen. Um, 
or more than likely it won't happen. I, I don't know if you go in to purchase um, a, a substantial bag, they may go ahead and give you an, an essay. But um, other than that, don't call them up to give Key Clay and ask for an essay. That is not going to happen. So let's open it up little bag that comes with the key place. Oh my goodness. I, I'm sorry about this. Oh, uh, okay. This one is in the black on front leather. It has the LV stamped on the um, zipper there. With the on front leather zipper pull. Um, on the inside, let me take the cards out, you'll get a couple of little cards that'll help you identify. Let me excuse my, my nails, y'all. Um, I know they need help. And this is Steph in a ball cap day. <laughs> Um, it has a little um, clip. In these clips, you pull them down. Oh, excuse me. You pull them up from the bottom and pull them out. And then you put it down. Like I said, don't look at the nails. Do not look at the nails. They are hard. I'm so sorry. But there again, let me do that so you can see that. You pull up and out. And I'm getting things done around the house and in the yard today. This will be on. Um, some point to the casino so I didn't want to so it just yeah and just show you what yes let me get something out of my bag this is my hammock bag if you've never purchased Hammett before, I'm not sure if it's a, an exclusive Tillwards bag, but they're great too. Okay, so here's my driver's license for, for instance, and that's, that's what. That's what. This is basically used for it's like a card pouch, and I do have a card pouch, but you can put anything in there. I just wanted to show you it is about the size of a card, um, and maybe about half an inch longer. Um, so it's it's really sizable. These are really durable. Um, it has. Louis Vuitton Paris, made in France. And just a beautiful little piece. Just a beautiful little piece. Zipper seems to be a little tough on this one. But the stitching and everything looks good. Yes, it's very lovely piece. Very lovely piece. And it will go with a lot of the um, unprint leather that, that I've got in the black on unprint leather. I think I'm going to do it. It is just lovely. It is wonderful. 
So, of course, you get your little card there. And you get And this just says, um, well, that personally is just made him. You can't read it, so I'm just going to tell you what it says. It tells you that it's made of cowhide leather and that it was made in France. So, yes, you should get two little tags. Um, the third tag was really neat. Never got one of those, but I'm sure. So, yes, that's this one. So let's go to the next. And my um, she shed is just right off from the swimming pool. And we did use it to put um, the floats and and stuff like that in it. So that's what the umbrella is doing behind me. But, um, so that's our first little beauty. Thank you, Louie. Thank you. Now let's go for the next one. Aww. And let me just, because I realize some of you have never made this purchase. So let me. Oh, see, it comes with a little gift card. Um, and usually I don't open these, but I got them. See what my little essay. Okay, well, it's just mine. <laughs> I just wondered if she had put a little message in there or not, but isn't that cute? So if you're gifting these, um, that's a great idea. Again, the um, price increase is coming September the 1st. So um, my recommendation is, and I know you're rocking there. Um, my recommendation is is if you're planning on making Christmas purchases from Louis Vuitton or any of the top designers, and you don't, you're planning on putting it on your card or whatever, you got funds to buy it or whatever, do it. Pull the trigger, do it now, because um, we don't know what this next price increase is gonna look like. And from what we've seen, it's not been pretty before, so um, it could make a big difference in your in your Christmas bill, you know. So, um, yeah. So I go ahead and let it, anything you want to get, you better go and get it. Slip a little drawer out. been waiting for so long for this oh my goodness and I did purchase one on eBay and had to send it back because it was not authentic and I, I was really mad about it it was a it was a pretty decent dupe but I knew that it was unauthentic and I was really mad about it because um, eBay doesn't authenticate um, below a certain amount. So, if you're going to buy something like this on eBay, go ahead and pay to get it authenticated before you make the purchase. And they can do that by the pictures. Um, so, um, because once you made that purchase, and eBay and PayPal will get your money back, okay? If you buy it, if you if you if you buy it, so don't let that deter you from buying from eBay. Um, uh, but just know that you may end up having your money tied up until you can get your money back. But if you purchase through PayPal with eBay, 
then you're going to get your money back or with your credit card. Uh, your credit card company will get your money back, I think. But I know for sure that PayPal would. So I know I always pay with them. Because, like I said, it's been several times that I purchased things and they ended up not being authentic, particularly before they started doing the authentication. Um, of course, it has the LV on the um, zip pull on both sides. It has a little clip key ring. Um, clip, you know, just put it on your D ring on the inside of your bag. And um, these are all little tags. Now I'm going to send you some plate. Oh, I'm so happy. I am so, so happy. Um, I am uh, trying to put together a collection. So everything I want to coordinate. And this piece, like I said, was so hard to get. I could not get it ordered online. Could not um, find one um, payload that I was sure was authentic and was really at my wits end and started to go in the um in the store just to buy one um but thank god for my little essay she sure has has pulled it out for me and that's why one is so important and if you want that loot bag, um, watch Marquita LV. Um, she's telling you how to get an essay and to get signed up for that bag. Because they're going to go. They're going to go. Okay? But, um, and she's the only one I know of that actually even has one yet. Um, I can't see exactly if this one was made in France. I think so. I think so. And a lot of people look at them and see, you know, how tight the stitching is. Some people are really picky about that. Okay, and let me tell you that I'm not. <laughs> and I'll tell you why. Um, I understand that you don't want your piece to fall apart, but how many people have had their key clay fall apart? I mean, I just want to show of hands. Why are we looking at the key clay like that? I mean, can somebody answer that for me? Because if you can, put it in the description below. I'm not being sarcastic. I'm being for real. Why are we doing that? Why are we looking to see if we can see any daylight through our key clays? Does it matter? Is it going to fall apart? Because if it is, I'd like to know. Because if not, I'd like to quit looking stupid and looking at the damn key clay. <laughs> to see if I can see light through it. Because I'm not going to put water in it. So somebody please let me know. <laughs> um, because yes, I can see through it, but it does match up very well, and I don't have a problem with that, with it not being um, exactly perfect, and I know that a lot of people do, you know, and it's like we're, at this point, we're just looking for little flaws. Now, if, if something's obviously not right, you know what I mean? I mean like a wonky cut or um, glue or, you know, something, you know, really, you know, like what's going on with the Chanel bags? Okay, that's real. And, and I feel that. But, um, and that's a real issue. But being able to see daylight through your key clay, come on, people. 
I mean, seriously, somebody explain that to me so I can quit feeling stupid that I ever did that. And I don't mean that ugly. And I don't blame you if you do, if that's your thing, you feel like that helps you and it reassures you. Um, but, um, yeah, I would really like to know that. Yes, I finally got it. I finally got it. And thank you for sharing my experience. Thank you. I know I'm crazy. I have a lot in my mind. But if you just knew how many late nights that I have stayed up and tried to catch this key card. And every time they would send me an email that it was on the stop because that's on notification, I would run to the computer and I would try to order this bad boy and it would not go, it would not happen. It would not happen. So, if you want one, you're having a hard time finding them, spend you some money with Will Vuitton, get you an essay, and they will help you out. And um, thanks for stopping by and um, watching the video. And like I said, yes, I am in a good mood and trying to be funny and everything like that, but seriously, if there is a reason if people do that, I would really like to know. And um, I'm not laughing at you, honey. I'm laughing with you. Um, trust me. I love everybody out there. Everybody has their own ways of doing things. And I don't blame you if it's a lot of money and you want to make sure that everything's just right. Um, but if you're going to do that, I recommend going in the store and making the purchase. And that way that you can look it over really good. And you know what you're getting. Okay? And everybody have a great day. And um, wherever you are in the world, I hope that uh, peace and love finds you. And I hope that you will come back and see me. Um, hit the subscription. Um, if you want to keep up with my unboxings, I never know when something's coming in. I've got things coming in all the time. And uh, one of these days, that may just cut off. So I'm just riding the lightning. Um, Y'all right? welcome to ride the lightning with me, and we'll learn about these things together along the way. And um, chit-chat with me. Let me know about your bags and your experiences. If you have any questions about this one that I can help to answer, we'll help a sister out any day. Um, so, um, Y'all have a great day and come back to see me. Bye.